know, there's a lot of dubious information on the internet, but one alleged figure I see resurfacing all the time is that one that's like, oh, real scientists released an official lab study that uh, every human swallows uh, eight spiders in their sleep every year. But every time I hear that stat, I can't help but think, that's baloney. So I decided to get to the bottom of it. Hold my calls. I enlisted the help of a woman named Diana Terranova, a professional spider handler. I want to try to put some spiders on this bed and see if they will go into my mouth. The spider woman was very friendly, and I did not like it. Well, I will put spiders on any part of your body that you want to have them put on. Let's just stick with this for now. Like I said, I think that's plenty. After some idle chit chat, Diana got down to the sexy business of placing spiders directly onto my face. But most people have backyards and orb spiders, especially in the fall come in from your backyard. So this could happen. Been to you. Oh, oh no. See, he's making a web. Oh, swing, swing, swing. A spider would go in your mouth if they thought it was a safe place to hide out, right? Uh-huh. For the purposes of this experiment, I tried to keep my mouth open and inviting, like a cozy shelter of flesh. Oh. What repels a spider? Vibrations, breath, heartbeat, talking, anything that resonates at any hurt, especially the lower hurt, sound very scary to a spider and make it think of a predator. So, oh, just right in my eye. Okay, that's fine. Okay. These are just friendly creatures and uh, boy, are they a lot of fun. Having just put a spider on my face, the spider woman decided that the next step would be to put a different spider on my face. Shane, do any of your friends live in their parents' basements? I mean, probably. So maybe one of your friends has had a cellar spider or two walk on their face at night. Okay, all right. Go in Shane's mouth. See, he's on your mouth, but mm -hmm. you still won't go in. Sometimes the spider woman told me to do things that I did not like. Here, stick your tongue out even. Okay. What? But I did them in the name of science. Literally, it won't stay. <laughs> it's on the edge, but it just won't go in. Okay. Won't go in. Uh -uh. The spider woman continued to put spiders on my face. Let's even test the theory that spiders of different ages may crawl into your mouth. Here we have a baby rose hair tarantula. This one's actually kind of cute. Did you know that your skin is almost the same tone as a baby rose hair tarantula? Is that a compliment? Heading into this experiment, I considered myself relatively unfazed by spiders, but I had failed to consider the whole on the face aspect of this scenario. And so I began to sweat. So even as a baby, a spider or tarantula has a fully developed awareness to stay away from a person's mouth because your mouth feels like a large predator to them. At this juncture, I felt as though the point had been made, but the spider woman was tenacious. I... But you want to hear the funniest thing about boy tarantulas and if they went on your face? What? Is that when boy tarantulas come in your home, when they're in search of a mate, uh -huh. they um, take the sperm from their abdomen and they put it on their front pedipalps so that it's like ready to go. So when a spider, a boy spider walks on your face, uh -huh. he's walking on your face with like his sperm, like 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 all over your face. Okay. And I'll well. even blow the spider. Uh -huh. in the direction of your mouth, and let's see if she'll even go there. Oh, great. I began to suspect that the spider woman was sort of into this. See, she just won't go in his I mouth. Know, the there. spider woman had so many spiders. <gasps> it's an Olio spider. It's the largest of the huntsmen. God, they all love Shane's nose. I have a great nose. Mm -hmm. It's not biting me, it's I'm noticing. It's not biting, because I'm not a threat to the spider, nor are you. Plus, you're not prey, so they have no reason to bite us. Oh, avoided the mouth. Even a huntsman won't wait in your mouth. Look at that. Easy at peasy. That. It's like Christmas. Yes, it's like Santa with just, eight legs. That's not what this is like at all. Yes, it is. Okay. And so, after repeated trials, it had been proven that spiders did not care to seek comfort in my gaping maw. But remember, everybody, please, please, you shouldn't try this at home. No one's going to try this at home. Well, you would try it at home. I am not going to try this at home. They'll totally try this. No home. one will ever. Because everybody wants to be like you, Shane. Please stop putting spiders on my face. I lost it. You don't know where it went? No. I <laughs> went in your shirt. Oh, did he? Yeah. Okay, you should get him out of there. <laughs>